Hi, I'm Dr. Phil Stieg, and I'm here today to talk to you about a specific tumor type that can occur both in the brain and in the spinal cord called hemangioblastoma. These are unusual tumors, actually quite rare, but they are very vascular in nature. They have very specific radiographic findings. Hemangioblastomas are diagnosed with an MRI scan or maybe initially with a CT scan. But once we have the diagnosis basis on MRI, we frequently will get an angiogram. And with the angiogram, we might also want to embolize, put glue or particles into the vessels that is feeding the tumor. Subsequently, we will recommend surgical excision. The reason for removing the tumor is that we are worried about number one, growth, but number two, that it could bleed. The surgery that's used is dependent upon the location of the hemangioblastoma. To get this information, you should come to a major medical center such as Weill Cornell Medicine, New York Presbyterian Hospital, and speak with a neurosurgeon that will help guide you through the diagnosis, treatment options, and the risks associated with those options. I'm Dr. Phil Stieg. Feel free to contact me anytime.